हेलो एवरीवन वी विल कंटिन्यू द टॉपिक फंक्शन मॉड्यूल एक्सिट इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी स्टडीड हाउ टू फाइंड ए फंक्शन मॉड्यूल एक्सिट नाउ वी विल जंप ऑन टू हाउ टू इंप्लीमेंट ए फंक्शन मॉड्यूल एक्सिट एंड इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी केम ऑन टू द कंक्लूजन दैट दिस फंक्शन मॉड्यूल will help us to pass the soul to party by default it means we will write our logic into this function module now to implement any type of customer exit i am saying i am using the word customer exit so if you want to implement function module exit if you want to implement menu exit if you want to implement screen exit any type of customer exit if you want to implement we have a dedicated transaction code c mode as of now we will implement function module exit so we will go to c mode transaction code after few videos whenever we will implement menu exit and screen exit also at that time also we will go to see more transaction code so to implement any type of customer exit whether it can be your function module menu or screen you always always has to go to see more transaction code so see more transaction code is to implement a customer exit now i'll just go to the recap in the previous video you studied about s mode transaction code and if you remember with the help of s mode we find the customer exit see i am again using the word customer exit it means you can find function module exit you can find menu exit you can find screen exit all these three types of customer exit you can find through s mode if i will go for the recap in the previous video when you go went to s mode transaction code and you put the package name of the program you can see you are getting the customer exit name in the customer exit if we have a entry here it means function module exit if you have a entry here it means that is menu exit if you have a entry here that is your screen exit it means you can find any type of customer exit through s mode if you want to implement any type of customer exit you have to go for c mode so it's a golden rule if someone ask you what is the transaction code to find a customer exit answer is s mode if you want to implement any kind of customer exit c mode customer exit mean it can be your function module exit it can be your menu exit it can be your screen exit now we will perform some dedicated steps firstly we will learn firstly we will implement function module exit and then we will go for our further types of exits now what is the first step we will go to c mode transaction code to implement a function module exit we will go to c mode transaction code after going to c mode transaction code if i will go for the step by step you have to pass a project name and you have to click on to create button so in c mode transaction code the first thing you have to give a project name suppose i am saying we are implementing function module exit so i will give say function exit and i will use some serial number i will click on to create i will give the short description suppose project to provide soul to party so what is the first step we did we went to c mode transaction code 
and we gave we, we provided a project name and we gave that description now we will go to enhancement assignment tab what is the next step you have to go to enhancement assignment tab i'll click on to enhancement assignment i will save this as a local object suppose now this is the most important step and many people will confuse here here what we have to pass here what we have to pass see we are implementing function module exit as of now in the future we might implement menu exit in the future we might implement screen exit but all these types of exit are of what they all belongs to customer exit so you have to pass the customer exit name here so if you remember or i will show you again how you can pass the customer exit name you can go to s mode you can go for same to same process you can pass your package name i think system is slow i'll wait i'll pass the package name see this is your customer exit name this is your exit name you have to pass this name so you just copy this name and you have to pass here and i will press enter now i will click on to components tab you can see what is the next step you have to click on to components tab and now you will automatically understand whenever i will click on to the components tab whatever is in this customer exit it will automatically available in the components tab it means whatever the function module exit are in this customer exit whatever the menu exit are there in this customer exit whatever the screen exit are there in this main in this customer exit all will be available in the components tab so in this customer exit what are the various components available so i'll simply click on to components tab and you can see in this particular in this particular customer exit we only only have a function module exit are you getting same to same function module exit yes now you simply simply has to double click on to this function module is this the same to same function module yes here in this function module we will write our own code now i will come on to the most most important part see this topic customer exit we called it as enhancement yes it is a enhancement what is the meaning of enhancement you will enhance the sap functionality in customer name space c is this include name starting with z yes that's why we are saying that customer exit is a enhancement c it is a sap function module i can understand but in this sap function module in which name space you will write your code it is starting with z it means we are enhancing the sap logic in customer name space that's why it is called as enhancement now i will double click it is a warning press enter yes i want to create this include see we are creating a customer specific include which is starting with z which is starting with z now we all know if you we want to take a output from the function module we can always take through export and what is the export parameter e underscore cooler it is the output parameter for sold to party so i'll simply double click and i will write suppose e underscore tuner suppose customer is saying it sold to party is 1029 it depends upon customer but it is saying i will activate this include so you have you so what you did 
you wrote the logic you have written the logic you have written your own logic into this particular function module and in which, which namespace you have written the logic it is starting with set now i will go to back button now next important step people will do up to this level but they will tell at the last that the output is not coming because see your project is still still in the red mode so you have to activate first i'll go to change mode i will activate this now it is in green color it means whatever we did whatever the function module exit we implemented now it will trigger so i'll just go for the summary what we studied in this particular video in this video we studied that if you want to implement any any kind of customer exit any type of customer exit you always has to go for c more transaction code in c more transaction code you have to give a project name first after giving the project name after creating the project you have to click on to enhancement assignment and you have to give you a customer exit name once you will give you a customer exit whatever is available in that customer exit it can be function module exit it can be menu exit it can be screen exit all will be available in the components tab all will be available in the components tab you can double click we want to implement function module exit so we double click on the function module in that function module we have a include starting with z and in that include we have written the logic same so same steps has written when you double click on the function module exit you navigate to one function module you have written the logic in the z include of the function module and the last important step we learned that we need to activate our project in the next video we will see in the debugging mode that whatever the function module exit we implemented is it giving the expected output or not so that's it in this video thank you